Hello, I'm Sylvia Taylor, Chief Marketing Officer here at ProList. Welcome to the first installment in our new video series. This series is focused on all things direct mail and direct marketing. In each segment, we'll take a look at a particular topic or production function that we think is both helpful and interesting. Today, we're taking a deeper dive into digital inkjet printing. Many of you may already know that ProList has two Konica Minolta AcuraJet KM1 sheet-fed inkjet presses, but did you know how many different substrates the KM1 can actually print on? Let's take a look. For starters, because the KM1 utilizes UV ink, which is cured by UV light, there's fundamentally no drying time. The ink cures instantly. This opens up many possibilities for printing on different substrates. I have a few products here to show you as examples. All of these items were printed here on the KM1. First, I have a membership card, which is printed on 15 mil PVC plastic. Next, I have a magnet printed on 17 point magnetic stock. I also have a few racing bibs printed on 18 pound Tyvek. A window cling printed on 8 mil white vinyl. And finally, a photo, which we turned into a mounted wall hanging. This piece was printed on 17-point art canvas, which is a nice linen-type textured stock. While it's fun to look at printed samples, it's even more interesting to watch some of these specialty products run on press. Let's go take a look, because I know we're testing a new stock today. So what we have running here is a stock by the name of Rainbow Silver Sand. It's a 13 point paper stock with silver foil on one side. And in the silver foil, there are flecks of rainbow holographic micro glitter. This makes it a really nifty substrate for all sorts of marketing, collateral, premiums, and other high-end print components. We're actually going to use this product for some bookmarks we're producing here in-house, and that's what you see printed here. The press sheets are immediately ready to go right to finishing and die cutting. And since we're here, let's take a look at that as well. This is our Horizon Rotary die cut system. It can do both die cutting and kiss cutting depending on the height of the blade. It's great for short run specialty products. And the Tyvek bibs we looked at earlier in this section were die cut and hole punched in a similar manner. So now you can see the final product with uh, rounded corners and a hole punched for the tassel in the bookmark. Well, that wraps up our video feature for today. I hope you enjoyed taking a look at the production side of things and learning more about the variety of substrates that are available for digital printing. If you would like to learn more about the KM1 and watch a longer video clip on the technology behind it, please visit our website, select Direct Mail, then Print Services. For a full list of all the substrates available for printing on the KM1, please reach out to us via email, LinkedIn, or the contact form on our website. Thank you, and happy printing.